Hey everybody, thanks for tuning into my YouTube channel. Today I am going to be unboxing, ooh, an unboxing video. Something that I got in the mail. This. Let's see what it is. Let's see what happens. Let's see what it looks like. I held off opening this to do this video, okay? I've had this now for like a week. Uh. Oh my gosh. So this is the first thing I see. Oh my gosh. Super cute box. So Chonger, Chonk, Chonker. I want to make sure I'm saying this right. This is a company in China, so that's why I'm making sure I'm pronouncing it correctly. You can see. So these guys make very realistic looking pets. And again, this is my first time seeing this. So I'm going to open it now. You can see it. I'll put it right here. Ooh, wow. Super nice packaging. <laughs> Look how cute. Oh my God, you're so cute. <gasps> so you all are getting my first impressions because again, I did not open this before this video. I had to wait, I had to wait. Yeah, that's my real cat. That's one of my real cats. Um, so this cat is super cute. This is gonna be part of the uh, Memorable Pets collection now, right? I love working with Memorable Pets. They have a great selection of, of pets. And um, there's a bunch of options out there. This I really, really like. High quality, um, super soft, super soft, squeezable, but really realistic looking. What's great about these, like the robotic, you know, versus the robotic cats is these are a little bit easier to clean for one. Um, and two, you know, you don't need to start with a, a robotic pet. If you're concerned about introducing your loved one to a stuffed animal, you know, you don't need to start with a robot. Either way, you start the same. So if you have a, a cat or a dog or even a baby doll that you want to introduce to your loved one living with dementia, introduce it like this. What do you think about this? Right away you're going to know because they're going to say, oh, a, oh, a, a, a cute cat. Or they're going to say, oh, a stuffed animal. And whatever they say is the right answer, right? So it, it takes all the pressure off. You don't have to be worried about what they're going to say or think. Um, and I've had a lot of people who some days they think this is real and some days... It's, it's fake and you just kind of flow. You go with the flow, right? You go with, uh, you embrace their reality and you go wherever their reality is at that moment. Okay, so I really like this. Even the paws are detailed. There's a lot of detail on this cat. Super cute. Um, and you can also get pets that look like people's cats or dogs. So that's pretty cool as well. Um, it's a nice size. It's not huge, but it's not tiny either. It's not like a typical stuffed animal that you would see. So that's great. Super soft. Makes you kind of want to like do this. Um, yeah, I'm really liking this cat. It's not real heavy, but it's also not real light. So it's not going to be difficult for the person to carry around. I love the eyes on it so you can get a close look. Isn't that cute? Um, really realistic looking yeah this is a really nice product it's also going to be a better price point than if uh you're looking to get the robotic cat or dog that's going to be a little bit more expensive those are a little over 100 bucks this is going to be a better price point especially if you're just trying it out for the first time and you're not sure if your loved one's going to like the cat or the dog i would start with something that's not robotic just to see and if they do love it, you can always go from there. Again, when you're introducing this, what do you think about it? Really cute product, um, very soft, and there's my actual cat shoes. What do you think about this? Hey, shoes. She likes the box, so 
Shoes. Come on, pay attention to the cat. You know you're not really supposed to be on the counter at all. Okay. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Loving this cat, very cute, very soft, from Chonker. Again, this is the company. Um, experience the fun of the fun of pet raising, but without the trouble of keeping pets. And again, if you have, and she's fully in that box. If you want to try this for a loved one, it's great because if they have dementia, they, they may have trouble keeping, uh, taking care of, of a real live pet. This is a great alternative. You don't need to care for it. And it provides in a lot of ways, the same amount of comfort and stimulation that a real cat could. This can also travel with you. And let me tell you, that does not like going in the car. This doesn't mind going in the car. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I hope this was a informative video for you and um, subscribe for more videos like this one.